Hey, good afternoon. This is Clay with Clay's AC and Auto Repair in Clay Motion in Grand Rapids, Michigan. If this video is helpful, please like, send me your nice comments, but most of all, subscribe. Check the little box to get my notifications for my videos. That helps me out a lot. Uh, remember, you can't break what's already broken, and this is one example of a shade tree mechanic type way to fix something, but it's actually a pretty darn good fix. Have you ever had a loose battery cable on a car like this and somebody has over tightened it first off you don't have to really tighten these up a ton you know if if you're supposed to have a, a pretty good gap in between there but they've over tightened it so much that they've stretched the metal around here now you can obviously replace this but let's say you're on the side of the road or you're on a trip and you don't want to do something i mean this needs to be replaced because it's stretched out but i'm going to show you a real quick simple solution to that all you need is a screw, it doesn't matter if it's a screw like this, a long one or short one, and you're just gonna screw it down in between them two parts. You can even loosen this eight millimeter or 10 millimeter bolt up, whatever yours is, and put this screw in between there. What it's gonna do is it's gonna grab into the lead on the top of the battery post, and it's also gonna grab into the metal on there. And it'll be a safe, secure way, and it'll last for ever until the next time you take the battery off. It can be a skinny nail, it can be a lot of things. But what you want to do is it to grab it into two parts. So we would just take this screw and screw it into here. And I'm going to show you that. So this is not the engineer, engineered way that we do this at the repair shop. But this is to help you on the side of the road or to help you get by this repair. Back before I owned an auto repair shop and I was a kid, um, my dad taught me this. Or I should say my neighbor was like my dad. But anyways, he taught me how to do this. It's a real quick, simple way of doing it, and this is what it looks like. It don't look pretty, but man, it's solid. You could leave that that way. Unfortunately, we can't ship things like this, you know, to customers and stuff when we're working on stuff, but I thought it was great to share. Remember, you can't break what's already broken. Don't be the next to them. Be the first to you. God bless. Have a great day.